hello. We've got a little video to do for you. Now, what we've we got to say first? Whose hmm. birthday is it? Jack. It's Jack's birthday. And how old is Jack? Um, four. Huh? Thirty. Sir, Jack's thirty. I think I look pretty good to have a 30 year old. Jack is three today. Jack has a t-shirt that says, stand up. I am three. I'm three. And then he's got his little sticker from nursery as well. Yeah. And he's just having a cookie and some chocolate milk. Um, chocolate we're just waiting milk? for Daddy to get home so that we can open his presents. And Daddy's just ruined my first attempt at filming by ringing to say he's only just left work. 20 minutes late. God, on you. So, um, it means we've got time to do a video. Um, so, yes, Jackie's getting a big boy. Um, yeah, I'm a big boy. You are a big boy, aren't you? Um, Thurman's over there doing his homework. His maths homework. Um, and he was being these, naughty and he was crying. He was being a bit naughty, wasn't he? But never mind, Snitch. Um, these are the first pair of slippers I made. Um, and this on the bottom is, um, I think it's by a brand called Tulip. And it's 3D glow-in-the-dark paint. So just to give it a bit of... A bit of grip. I don't know how how well it will work, but you know, this is for an adult. So if she chooses to go skidding across the floor, I probably won't be held responsible for her if she hurts herself. So there's it from the front. They do look just massive. Um, and there's the cuff all finished. I did it. Um, I just used the pattern as a really basic guideline because I got gauge, but it was way off. So. What should have been, I think this part should have been at the, on the biggest size, about nine rows. I think it ended up being 16. For, for, for a woman's, you know, a, a adult size six. So it's a good pattern though. And once you've got it, you know, the heel is great. Ooh, so I'm, I've got some more down here that I've got wet paint on. I'm trying not to touch them. So the heel is great. They come together really quick, obviously, because you're holding chunky wool double and then using a big hook. So. The fiddliest part, to be honest, is making the toes and then making these claws and stuffing them and, and getting them right. So that's pair one. Pair two went to their recipient at the weekend, which was my niece, because she saw pair one and went, Oh my God, can I have a pair for my birthday? Um, and that was on Sunday and her birthday was the following Saturday. So, uh, And then I ran out of wool. <laughs> so um, I didn't get the replacement bottle of wool till Friday. And I needed them for Saturday, so I had them done about 9 o'clock. Don't bang, because you're banging the table. Uh, they rock the camera. So I didn't get them done until about 9 o'clock Friday night. Oh. So stay there for a minute. Don't do the noise. Just a oh. second. I'll give you a cuddle in a sec. Don't be sad. Good smile for everybody. People don't want to see Jack's sad face, do they? want to see Jack happy face. <laughs> don't be sad, sack. Um, so, yeah, I did another pink pair with the yellow that noise, Jack. <laughs> Got a milk down shops. You got it everywhere. Um, anyway, I'm filming. So shh. Uh, and then I've got another three pairs to do for the same lady that's having these. So and Mummy these got are in, some of these. These are the first size one boy. Size one, like junior, I suppose. Um it's the same age as toes. And there's some paper inside. Yeah, he's a size one, but I've done them the same size as my niece because yes, she's a size two. Like just so they've got, because oh. I'm talking. They're not really going to grow in, you know, not really going to wear them, wear them until winter. So, I'll, well, excuse me, I'll give them a bit more room. So, this is the size two I'm doing. I've got to make another size two for a boy, so I might give him an extra row just to, to make it a bit, you know, so they'll last a bit longer. And so, hang on, don't touch them because they've got paint on them. These have got freshly applied paint them just waiting to dry everybody in. and then this is another size adult uh, size six him. hang on you just can't touch him you can show him the pink ones in a second you can hold them but you've I've got chocolatey hands so actually you can't hold anything um so yeah this is another um size six i've just got to finish off the last couple of toes and then i can start i can I enjoy won't fit that. i won't fit size six no this is huge i'll fit, so, I'll fit that um size six and a half it was just ten um oh. so yeah i've just got to make another one of these then i have a purple pair to make for the same family and that's that order done and then i've got to make another purple pair because my sister showed her friend 
picture of the ones I was, I don't know if these are the ones I was making for my niece. You've got really mucky hands, darling, you can't touch them. This one is clean. It doesn't look clean. No, sweetheart. If you go and get a wipe, you can. You gonna get a wipe? No. No, didn't think you would. Can we go out and play the play or be? You want to get out and go? You have to have a bite to everybody then when we finish this off. Bye! Go on down there. Um, okay. Do my own work. Alright, don't have it. Go down. Do my own work. It's like I'm not even filming. They don't care. I don't want my chocolate. Okay, sweetheart. No worries. Um, right, sorry. So, yeah. Put that in the bag if you've done. Um, yeah, my sister showed her friend these and... Her daughter was like, come on, come on, come on. so I should have enough left over. I I bought the wool um, based on the maximum yardage on the pattern Ma! and used no way near it. So the I my gauge should be Mommy. bigger or something. I, I don't know. Mommy, I don't know, Jack. Okay. You and your brother have lost it. So yeah, um, oh, I got two. I, I got a size it. six and a size I two. It, okay. Very good. Out of six balls of pink in the end. Um, and I've got pink left over. I was, I got to sort of round two on the cuff of the first slipper and ran out. So it's just literally the cuff to do. Jack, can you and these are held here? single, not double of the cuff. I need to, I need can you to not shout when I'm filming, in. please, boys? So, um, yeah, I've got... Oh, I've got what's gone? I'm talking. I've got a coin there. Talking. So I've got 11 balls of this petrol colour. No, so... Maybe the balls will get a pair, and I've got six balls of the purple colour, so I know I've got enough for two pairs. But I'm making two kids' pairs out of that, so. Uh, and the, you know, the, the, where did I get my extra ball that I need? I got it from Wool Warehouse. Um, and they were quite good on delivery, it's just it came when I was off work, you know, I had my Thursdays off, and it came on a Thursday. I thought, I'm not driving up to work again. So, I had it on Friday instead. Um, Oh, I'm rambly today, I'm sorry. Um, I haven't really, I'm still working on the blanket um, for a friend and I need to make a toy because Tobin's got a party on the 4th of July. And I foolishly said, what does uh, your daughter like? Oh, can you make a Pluto? And, I was like, and then I looked and I found a baby Pluto pattern, which is just Pluto the dog, the Disney dog. Um, I was like, yeah, I can make a planet, and I, <laughs> I just make a ball. No one ever wants just a ball, do they? No. Um, so, yeah, I found this baby Pluto pattern, and it's adorable. Only problem is, it's in Spanish, so I spent last Thursday, I think, translating it from Spanish to English. Hopefully, it's okay. And I could probably do it on the numbers, but there's certain... Um, it's a free pattern. I'll link to it below. But um, there's certain... Uh, increase rounds that aren't just you know one stitch one increase one stitch one increase so um so to, obviously to do with the shape so I, I can't just fudge it well i will fudge it but i couldn't just not bother to try you know just go on the numbers so i'll get started on that yeah. at some point i kind of want to get through these slippers lovely <gasps> did you hear that i'm so sorry whoa go and get on the potty Go and get on the potty. There's no one there. <laughs> it's real, people. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, I think I might have to go before anything gets even more real. Um, what was that noise? So, I hope everybody's okay. Sorry it's been a little while since I've done a video. I kind of get a bit bogged down. I seem to have a lot of the same project to do at once, and it's a bit... I just want to get through it. I've, I've got stuff that needs doing, that I want to get, you know, I want to do, uh, and I'm not getting there, so I need to get this stuff done, get out of the way, and, you know, concentrate on, on some stuff, I think, I actually think I'm going to start some Christmas stuff, because it's June, why is it June, people, why is Jack 3, <laughs> God, God, Jack, you and Tevin learned to ride his bike yesterday, I know you're there, sweet pea, Tevin learned to ride his bike yesterday, because uh, he's got an awesome bike, so yeah. if I remember, I'll stick a photo, down there? No, I'll take a photo at the end of the video. I bet that turns it round and I'm pointing the wrong way. Um, so yeah, I'll take a photo in if I remember of his snazzy new bike. And yeah, so I'm going to go get some tea on um, so that we can open Mr. Jack's presents. 
and uh, yeah, hopefully I'll get settled down and watch Game of Thrones and crochet some more slippers later. So, I hope everybody's okay. I will hopefully see you again a bit sooner, maybe with a different project, you never know. Oh dear. Right, speak to you all again soon. Bye. Bye.